Copyright disclaimer under Section 107 of the Copyright Act 1976. Allowance is made for fair use for purposes such as criticism, comment, news reporting, scholarship, and research. Fair use is a use permitted by copyright statute that might otherwise be infringing. Nonprofit, educational, or personal use tips the balance in favor of fair use. Hey guys, how you all are doing? I hope you're doing well. Before we start, this video is for educational purposes only. Everything shown here is meant to help users understand and troubleshoot common STEAM issues. I do not encourage any kind of misuse, illegal activities, or violating STEAM's terms of service. This tutorial is only to help people fix the purchase problem and restore their already existing files. So please use the information responsibly. All right, let's begin. Today I will show you how you can fix the purchased problem on Steam. If you're using Steam tools, V8 tools, or any similar tools, then you may already know that sometimes Steam suddenly starts showing purchase on the games you already downloaded. Or sometimes all the games you added in your Steam library disappear completely. So in this video, I will show you step by step how to fix that problem and bring all your games back successfully. Make sure to watch the video carefully, otherwise the method might not work. And if it still doesn't work, let us know in the comments. You can also join our Discord server. The link is in the description and comments. All right, let's get started. Method one, clear download cache. As you can see in my Steam library, all the games I downloaded using Steam tools are showing purchased. Free games will not show this. This issue only happens with games added through Steam tools or V8 tools. To fix it, one, click the Steam button at the top left corner. Two, go to settings. Three, open downloads. Four, scroll down and click clear download cache. Five, press confirm and Steam will restart automatically. After the restart, check your library. If your problem is fixed, great. If not, no worries. Continue to the next method. Method two, use ST, fix tool. For this method, join our Discord server. Inside the server, you'll find a category called Downloads, and inside it, a channel named Tools. If you're new, you may not have access to this channel. To unlock access, subscribe to our YouTube channel, take a screenshot, send it in the sub-verify channel. Our team will verify you and give you the subscriber role, which unlocks many channels, including tools. In the tools channel, download the tool named STFIX. Install and open the tool. Once opened, follow these steps. One, click the decrypt button. Two, a pop-up will appear. Click OK. Three, click the three dot poo button. Four, now find all your Steam library folders in every drive on your PC. Check your drives. C, D, E, F, G, H, however many you have. While whenever you find a Steam library folder, select it, click Decrypt, press OK. Do this for every Steam library folder you have. After completing all folders, close the Estefix tool, restart your Steam. When Steam loads, it will show loading user data. Give it a few seconds. As you can see, the purchase problem is fixed and all my games are back in my library. Method three, use a VPN. If the above methods did not work, there is one more trick that may help. Use any VPN. I personally recommend Urban VPN connect to Indonesia or any other country. Restart Steam afterward. For many users, this immediately fixes the issue. If not, try different servers or countries. Remember, this video is for educational and troubleshooting purposes only. Please use all tools responsibly. Our goal is to help users fix errors and understand how to manage their files safely. If this video helped you, make sure to like, subscribe, and share with your friends who face the same problem. Join our Discord server for more support. Our management team is always available to assist you. More tutorials and updates are coming soon. Thank you for watching. Take care. Stay good. Love you all.